Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to God of War Anawak. And welcome back <coughs> to our playthrough on Give Me God of War difficulty with most of the HUD features turned off. We are now heading into Vanaheim alongside Fire. Hey, how's about a riddle to lighten the mood? What runs with no legs? Easy, a nose. You'll have to try harder than that, Brock. Just you wait, smart guy. <laughs> Come on, let's find a way forward. Through here. Oh no. Something's wrong. My spell, I can feel it slipping. Well, that's Pimple Winter for you. You don't understand. I'll be torn from the realm. What can be done? Something I was hoping to avoid. Seems I don't have much choice. Falcon! <sighs> Come on, then. You had a way around Odin's curse this whole time. No. I discovered it once you unlocked realm travel. And it solves very little. This form is extremely limiting. That's Thimble Winter for you. Not. <laughs> Watch where you're going. The plants are extra aggressive in this humidity. Brother, do you really think she'll let us off the hook if you help her? I do not know. I choose to help. After that, we will see. Ah. I recognize Come a long way, Kratos. There's another runic attack. Villagers would meet and trade here. Why'd they never rebuild? Looks like they sure left behind a lot of goodies. Shame to let them collect dust. That's one way of looking at it. Juices flowing. Forgot how much I like scrapping dirt. Oh. 
More hack silver. Boy, you don't miss a scrap of loot, do you? Where has everyone gone, I wonder? They must have withdrawn, hidden themselves out in the wilds, and covered their tracks with magic. No way of knowing how many are left or how to reach them. Aesir ran cockshot all over this place, huh? Hmm? You can thank Mimir for that. War with the Vanir was never my idea. My idea was brokering the marriage to end it. A great success that was. <laughs> Obviously, the peace was no less a disaster than the marriage. Did he invade again, as soon as I was exiled? Good question. Seems likely. This here would have made for a prime shop location. Dwarves in Vanaheim? That would be something to see. Uh, let's see. written poetry of your own brother? No. Well, ask a stupid question. Kvasia's Poems. A masterful sonnet by Kvasia, weaver of pulpy fictions. The lure of adventure is a powerful thing, for this man from small beginnings. With his pluck, his wit, and his ancestor's ring, he aims to add to his winnings. To distant lands this man would travel, accompanied by partners and friends. And though their plans would oft unravel, they'd all make it through in the end. In ancient rites of mystery and wonder, priceless treasures lay there for the taking. Into, sticking situ sti into sticky situations he'd often blunder. Everything he touched would end up breaking. If for you the desire for thrills still lingers, be ready for anything and strengthen your fingers. You are this, Gangalai! 
Being here again's bringing back memories of that red Fancy folks and quality meats. And though I remember your brother stirring up an awful scene. Why do you keep bringing him up? <laughs> My brother is no concern of yours. Do you understand? Oh, I understand plenty. Also, still need the uh, whiplash. Push the light on the heavy. God damn it, my brain short circuited. I don't I don't remember. Did we pick up what was on the other side here? <laughs> I think we did. But man. Yeah, my brain is not uh, operating at full capacity at the moment. Um a little tired. So I apologize for backtracking. Yeah, we did get it. Plant life grows more dangerous the further we go. Hope you're up for it, Lord. Listen, I know how bad it can get with one's own kin. Sindri and I were on the out so long it was like not having a brother at all. Now nah, I take some of the fall for that on account of me walking out. But it never stopped me blaming him most. Any of this sound familiar so far? And what is your point? My point is, that weren't the end all of things after all. Once we got our heads right, it was like no time had passed. He went straight back to being as big a pain in my ass as he ever was. That's family. You gotta keep them close, or they make you good and crazy. Why do you think I need to hear any of this right now? My focus is on regaining my freedom, and I have no intention of being distracted. Look, all I'm saying is, if you happen to find yourself talking to your brother, maybe the worst words said between you don't have to be the last one said. Enough! When the day comes to face Freya again, it will be when I am standing on my feet and free. You understand me? It will not be while I'm stuck in this preposterous situation. Got a case of pride, I get it. Hope yours clears up quicker than mine did. A touching story, that was. Fight me. You wish. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good banter.
What did Odin do to drive everyone away? What weapons did he make the dwarves build him? How much was just Mjolnir? Can one man do this much damage? Depends on the weapon. And the man. Shiny. It is a little shiny. This river. Metal. It used to be filled with boats of people visiting from different villages. I've never seen it so empty. What is this? Not now, brother. We've got company. Skill check. What is this? Not now, brother. We've got company. One of them hairy ass <laughs> bastards. Yeah! Hey, call an old pecker's wrist. God damn it again. Button way too late, I guess. Huh? Yeah, no, we should not be hitting. What is now. this? Not now, brother. We got company. One of them <laughs> hairy ass bastards. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, I hit the shield bash button there. Fuck, now we're stuck. I don't even. Okay. Like, the game. Com the game bugged out there in terms of collision. Pretty substantially, I feel like. What is this? Not now, brother. We've got company. One of them hairy ass bastards! <laughs> Show me what you got! Got another one joining the party! Look alive! Lift up! You just made the last mistake of your life! Let's go! Over here! What the hell? Shit. 
After a couple of tries. Hold up! If you want to keep your insides inside. All yours, big guy. Oh. Your people not receiving visitors? I wouldn't know. They're not my people anymore. Give me a boost. <laughs> <clears throat> Don't go telling no one about that. Come on up. Bet you're glad old Brock's around to save your skin. Uh-oh. Yeah! What? We should probably go get him. Keep your guard up. Yeah, I didn't really intend on strolling down there leisurely. I have to admit. Busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing then. Am I right? No, no. No need for threats, brother. Oh, I know that voice. Cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye, oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. We sold my sister to that prick. We broke it a piece. Oh, did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me! I guess we'll settle for blood. Stop! What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Ingvi. There's no time to explain, just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. You can undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. So... You serve my sister. Oh. Oh. Don't we all? 
Put him down. What's with leaving me hanging like that, you crusty hag? Oh, can it, Blobber? Come here. Well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Fair. Freyas Lament. I can't do this. I mean, I have to do this. I write this because I can't say the words out loud. I write this because maybe, if all goes well, it'll be a funny reminder of the man I once was. A man who is scared, who is in over his head. A man who cannot stop asking himself over and over again a single question. What would she do? I'd love to ask her, but she's gone, so... I guess I have to answer on her behalf. She'd tell me to stop complaining. She'd tell me that I don't matter. That my fears, my inadequacies, are irrelevant. All that matters is making sure the people of Vanaheim can cast off the yoke of Vaisir rule. She'd tell me I'm <clears throat> allowed to be scared. I'm allowed to be angry. But above all, I have to be strong. The people of Vanaheim need a leader, and for the foreseeable future, it looks like I'm the best they're going to get. Man, I wish she was here. We fixed it so you can come and go between the realms whenever you please. You're very welcome. Go. This here's my family, and I mean much to you, but you made fun of me. It does to me. Otherwise, I wouldn't have made up with my clunker head brother. Five million moon beans. I didn't realize the Hulk brothers were back in business. We're even cohabitating like a proper family. So don't tell me. Oh, okay, well, well, then you can help me at the forge while you spill everything. Now, Brock, ain't you gonna introduce me to this tall glass of milk you got for a bodyguard? Of course I was gonna. That's Kratos. Though you can call him whatever pops into your head. Kratos, Lunda, we go back. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. Need something special? And uh, don't have enough stone wood. To upgrade the hilt. So buy resources now. What? You just came to stare? Sorry, we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. We're pretty used to only seeing Ace here in these parts. Don't typically get friendly faces. That that is a friendly face, right? His name is Kratos, and no, the Aesir on Vanaheim. <laughs> yeah, we've been occupied since... Yeah, I lost count. What is your plan? Still kind of working on it. Mm -hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. Well, I'll take what I can get. Your mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. He sure does forgive easily. Hey, Kratos, as long as you're working for my sister, carefully you don't screw up. She's not too big on forgiveness. A bit late for that one, I'm afraid. Freya. We have met Freya, the brother of Freya. In Vanaheim, he is an unusual god, roguish 
not as impressive as his sister, yet his allies seem loyal and include many I would not expect to cooperate. He does not resemble any great leader I have known, nor does he share their strengths. What makes him so able to unite former enemies? And will it work with fire? All right, let's see what we've got here. Tell me about your army. Oh, you're looking at it. What, you five? Against Odin's army? Well, six, if you count the dog. Oh, fuck me. Yep. Do you know their numbers? Oh, yeah, numbers, movements, outposts. We have good intel. Uh, short on help. I see. Well, let's have a look at the map then. All right. Well, we're gonna call it a day here, I think, once we get to the other side of the way. Now that the distractions are out of the way. I have words, if you would hear them. Speak, then. With anger you feel for your brother. I know it well. You have a brother? His name was Demos. When we were boys, he was taken by two gods obsessed with prophecy. The gods of my homeland seldom left survivors. So by the time I learned he had lived, it was too late for amends. His anger poisoned him against me. But I never stopped loving my brother. You think my anger is irrational? You've known Freya for mere moments, and already you're taking his side? I am not taking his... No. You're just sharing your thoughts on a subject you know nothing about. This is where we're going to call it a day, for now. Uh, thank you very much for joining me for today's episode, ladies and gentlemen. I really appreciate it. I hope you'll join me for the next one as we venture further into Vanaheim. Until then, please do take care, be safe, enjoy life, and um, good night, and good luck. Bye-bye. <laughs>